The Senate has also directed its committees on petroleum upstream, downstream, gas, Niger Delta affairs, health and environment to investigate the recent gas pipeline explosion in Bayelsa State. The motion was presented by Senator Bensi Kombobie, who highlighted the explosion in Yenegua local government area Bayelsa State. During the debate, lawmakers said there is urgent need for measures to prevent future occurrences and to address the health concerns of the people impacted by the explosion. Senate President Gosun Akbabio described the explosion, along with the resulting inferno and environmental pollution, as a very worrisome situation and urged the federal government to provide relief to the victims of the explosion. Alarmed that there was or there were huge explosions from a crude oil pipeline on Tuesday, the 14th of May, resulting in an inferno in the vicinity, in the vicinity of the gas facility. And this constituted a threat to the safety of the facility, which is a precious national economic asset. Observes that the explosions caused widespread panic among residents of the community where the explosion occurred. We don't believe that the executive understands the challenges that our people have been suffering all these years. But maybe if the joint committees look into the matter, we can have a report to look at and then interface with NMPC, uh, now whatever it is called, and then the operators and the regulatory bodies to see what steps can be taken to determine the adequacy of the measures that have been taken. It is a very worrisome motion because, um, the, first of all, the facility brings uh, serious foreign exchange to Nigeria because it is from there that the gas is processed and sent to the Boni terminal for export. So a very big source of foreign exchange earnings for our country. Because the people have no place to run to. Otherwise, they're going to the Atlantic Ocean. They have to live with it. Breathe the air. Those who had no asthma will now have asthma. And those who had no cancer will now have cancer. This must have gone on for the past 50 years. And unless you visit the area, you cannot understand. 